The Oasis Center was basically my home away from home when I was in high school. Um, I was in like four or five of their programs. <laughs> That's what happened with Epic Girl, but it's about basically empowering our women and making sure that we all feel safe in this world. We all know some methods to relinquish ourselves and bring ourselves back. Um, it's a pretty good program to empower us. Um, I really learned how to set boundaries. Um, I'm still working on it with some of my family members though, but I learned about setting boundaries and how to respect other people's boundaries in that moment. Um, it was a pretty good program to help me like catch the self-esteem that I didn't have at the time. I'm not in college at all right now. I messed up my financial aid. Um, I went from full-time to part-time and didn't know that that was gonna like basically void the contract with financial aid, but it did. Yeah, I had to move back to Nashville, Clarksville. And then I, um, I had to basically get a couple of jobs because I was helping family with bills and then I was helping myself with everything else. <laughs> so, yeah, I got a couple of jobs. I work at NCAC, the Nashville Career Advancement Center. I'm a research analyst there. I work at a church nursery. I'm a nursery staff. And I work at a, basically I'm an in-home DSS. I work with the mentally and physically disabled in the evenings. Um, I did the Opportunity Now program to get my um, internship at a like after school program because I was learning a lot about stuff that I felt like I seen all the time but never quite understood and I was also like contributing to um, helping that as well even though it's, it might not be able to um, help people now but I feel like I'm contributing to something that will help them. Um, I feel like everything is an attribute to who I am. I learn from every situation. If I don't see a blessing in it, I have to learn from it. Um, and I want to be a writer. Um, I'm going to school to kind of get my grammar and things intact, but I feel like if I wait too long, I won't go back because I can write now. I will write now, but I want to perfect it. I don't know. And I'm using my life lessons to kind of like attribute to some of the poems that I want to write about and things, so you'll see soon. <laughs>